Hi there, this is the Samsung Galaxy Note 3 and specifically this is the Exynos Octaco version and today is 8th October and what do we get? We get a software update. So it was pretty quick and uh, first let us look at the Android version that we have currently and the model number. Uh, specifically the model number for this is the N900 and as you can see this is the build etc and let's actually look at the software update. I got it over the air uh, and as you can see it just says that it's a stability update. Actually I'm not having any issues with the Note 3 it's uh, performing well. Only twice I had issues of uh, keyboard error uh, but stability it's nothing that I'm having any problems. So interesting to see that Samsung has uh, launched this update so let's quickly just install it and reboot and it was a 25 meg update. Do let me know if you're using a Samsung Galaxy Note 3. Uh, did you get this update uh, for the Snapdragon version? Specifically, this is the Octaco version that we have. And as you can see, it's uh, installing the update. And this is going to take some time. So I'll just uh, skip when it's done. And the update was actually done. It has rebooted the device. Now it's just optimizing the apps like all other android updates and this should also be done in a minute or so again make sure your battery is charged before doing all this again if you're using the uh, qualcomm snapdragon version do let me know in the comments if you're getting the update and uh, what did you notice about the update what changes did you feel uh, has the phone uh, performance increased decrease etc so the optimization of apps has been done and it should boot now Let me enter my lock and as you can see we got the message that the device is successfully updated and uh, let's quickly just look at the android version let's go to general let's go to about the device and this is the info the base band is this one and the build number is the one that you can see on the screen also let's look at uh, and see if we have any other updates let's try that and it's connecting to the server but i doubt we'll have uh, one more update and as you can see, we have all the latest updates applied already. So again, if you're using the Samsung Galaxy Note 3, do let me know if you got this update and what changes have you noticed to your device after this update. Again, it's too early for me to comment on this update because I just got it. Again, I'll be adding uh, my opinion in the comments after testing this update for a few days. Again, thanks for watching. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.